What gives a glass house a power of place is the scarcity and the abundance of its space. It feels like it's the right scale. You feel like you're on the planet Earth and that everything else is the universe around you. I'm John Maeda. I'm the next president of Rhode Island School of Design, RISD. Today at the Glass House, I participated in the Simplicity Conversation, inviting people from as far flung as France and Switzerland. The Glass House informed the conversation by providing a place like no other. It's a place where many conversations have happened in the past. So like a great bicycle, it's easy to ride for conversations to happen. I've been thinking about simplicity for a while. I wrote a book called The Laws of Simplicity to figure out simplicity. Then I realized by writing it, I got very confused about it. Since the book's publication, I've been meeting so many people who are teaching me about simplicity. At the Glass House site, cemented to me what simplicity not looks like, but it feels like. It's expansive, it's open, it's natural. It has nothing to do with technology, <laughs> and uh, it has everything to do with uh, humanity. When you have diverse opinions, backgrounds, age ranges, and you bring people together in a very special place, new things are invented. An unexpected idea that came up today was the question of values. How when we all have values, life is simpler. That was something I didn't expect, you know, faith-based values, scientific-based values. This place is trying to look like nature. Everything appears like it's all natural, and, but it's been um, touched by human hands. Uh, the trees are all trimmed, uh, the grass is trimmed, uh, even the, the stuff that looks like it's like not trimmed has been not trimmed, look like it's not trimmed <laughs> kind of thing. It's all been created as a kind of a, a wonderful illusion. When you hear the glass house, you think of the glass house, but the glass house is actually just one of the different amusement rides of the Philip Johnson mind. And so this is just the glass house. What you really want to come here for is a glass house's context, the environment. So think of it kind of like a, a second life. Uh, before people had second life, uh, Philip Johnson had second life. He said, make a mountain, make a hill, you know, make a museum, make whatever, you know, make a sculpture gallery. But it's real. That's, well, that's what's different. I wish I could come here all the time, but I, I can. It's, it's for someone who has the time to experience life. And that's quite a luxury.